Who are you? Uh -huh. You are a cobalt, hmm? Okay. I see you are from the fluffy variety of cobalts. Do you mind if I give you a <clears throat> pet on the head? No? Okay. <laughs> you seem to be liking that. I can provide more. How did you get here specifically into my room, huh? You just walk up here, huh? On my days. A tiny, cute, fluffy cobalt. On my desk. Hmm. That's weird. I don't... I don't remember leaving my door so... Hmm? Or my windows. So tell me. How did you get in here? Mm -hmm. Oh, that is most curious. Teleportation, huh? I didn't know. Little cute fluffy cobalt can teleport. Oh, it wasn't you. You were teleported. Hmm? By who? Uh huh. Oh, that's a shame. Why do wizards do that? Well, one may assume that My room is a lot better than an iron cage. No, I wasn't going to eat you. Way too many bones. Not a whole lot of meat. And way too much fur. I mean, look. Cobalts are as small as they are. Not on my menu. And they are way too cute. Especially little cute good boys like you. Yes. I did call you a cute boy. Oh no, I meant a good boy. Mm hmm. And you are just sitting here listening to me and doing nothing. Well, not precisely doing nothing. You are enjoying those headbands. Well... Wow. 
How about that? You seem to enjoy that. Especially for cute little good boys like you. And I heavily provide. Heavily provide. My dictionary seems to be all over the place today. I went, I happily provide. You are. Even though it sounds a bit wrong. Like an idle plaything for me. Yes, you can just sit there and be cute for me. Yes, that's still better than sitting in a cage and getting experimented on. Which I assume is the reason for you to be so fluffy, because I've never seen a cobalt being fluffy before. Yes. Can use my paws to gently cover your ears. Hold them and let go again, or just gently stroke them. Yeah. You seem to like that a lot. Which is great. Yes, it has been really long lately. Hmm, I don't know. I, as a woman, I'm not the biggest fan of rain, you know. It's a nice background noise. Certainly beats nothing. And white noise does also do a good job at a suppressant for random noises. You know, it masks pretty much everything at a given volume, of course. But not only that, at a low tool, medium volume, it really helps you sleep. Which, for an old wolf like me, is really a blessing. The effect of other noise being washed out or completely gone. So by that point, a great benefit. Ugh, excuse me, I'm getting tired. Well, I'm always tired. I don't know about you. Are oh, you tired? I mean, you certainly would be tired. Especially like if you hear so much. Yes, you are safe now. I won't be playing any tricks on you. We'll experiment on you. That's not what I do. Mm -hmm. When you're alone, you appreciate the company. 
You can lay back and relax. Everything is going to be okay. <laughs> 